Hello, Scorpio. Welcome to your weekly reading. This is January 16th through 22nd. Hope you're amazing. So we're going to do your general love and money and career. So for general Scorpio this week, we have hero or heroine in reverse, escapism and a false sense of heroism. And then we have the hungry ghost, obsession, scarcity, consciousness and attachment. Hmm. This week there's a fear of losing. Um I'm not I'm not sure why. I think it's because you're not in control or you don't know exactly what is happening, so you you know are feeling like things are just out of whack or not in the order that it needs to be, and that's just scarcity. Um of losing something like fear of loss um okay okay but what's interesting is uh from a bigger perspective you really don't have anything to be fighting for right now and that's probably a big part of it as well it's like you don't really have anything to be putting your energy into this week uh, but just being <laughs> pretty much just uh consistently doing day-to-day -day activities but you're a little bit like uh lost on what to do or how to take control of something it it could, it's very interesting because someone also could be confusing you or a situation could be confusing you and you're like oh i need to do something but there's nothing really to do it just looks like you need to just relax and enjoy and go with the flow for right now and keep doing what it is that you are doing what you don't see yeah i feel like you don't feel seen or recognized and um it's it's interesting because it feels like you need it like you need to be seen or recognized this week or you need to achieve something it's like that feeling of, of that underlying feeling of like needing that um but I feel like it's just a fear that you're not in control of something or fear that something will slip through your fingers so don't go like making quick witted or quick decisions this week. I will hang off or hold off for at least a week first, okay? And then in love, we have life purpose and let go of control issues. Yeah, your love life is, what I want to say to you, Scorpios, your love life is doing the thing that it does. I don't feel like there's a big problem that you need to be really um, focused on but you feel like you need to be for some reason and you just really need to go with the flow of of how things are unfolding it's it's going really well um without you interjecting anything new in to be honest with you yeah i feel like you're looking for something like you're almost on alert for something to happen or for you to hold something off um but yeah like i said it's it's like a sense of just like nothing is happening and you need to relax. You're just really antsy about things. Um, it seems like someone that you're dealing with may be acting a little bit out of sorts. I can see like you're not clear on their actions. You're not clear on what they're thinking. They could be, they could have said something to you and you're like, well, where is this coming from left field, you know? Um, but it's more, it gives me this feeling of like, just kind of let it go with the flow. I feel like it's going to work itself out. Let me see what you don't see. Yeah, what's interesting is, Scorpio, there's nothing you can really do right now. There's no kind of interjection that you can make that would change what's happening. So that's why it's more of you going with the flow of things. Um it's going to be steady. I don't see anything happening like a person leaving you or you finding out anything. It's more like this energy is this person. They're just an obstacle. Like they're like creating an issue that really doesn't have anything to do with you, I feel. Yeah, they just need some time to come out of their own head. You know, uh, I feel like they're still leaving some things in the past and it doesn't even have to be a person. It's just like, finding happiness in a new situation, in a new energy, okay? So in money and career, we have speaker and dreams of abundance. 
Yeah, this is a good time for you to get things done, I would say, to speak your mind. Um, I, I feel like if you have some ideas that you want to get across or express, this will be a really good time to do so. Yeah, it's like you're getting reconnected with your job, with your money, with other people. You're reconnecting with other people people in your job, especially if there were issues or you weren't getting along very well. Um, it could be that there was some issues some spitefulness or some defensiveness with somebody at your job in the past. And I feel like you're looking beyond that. It's more like sometimes they have to follow rules that don't necessarily mean, you know, that you, you're going to be the best of buddies. But I feel like you're looking past that and seeing the bigger picture of a situation. What you don't see Yeah, holding on to grudges and things like that will really be a hindrance to you, okay? So it's more like trying to figure out how to get along or how to, to make things um, compatible for both sides while you're still in this entanglement is what I'm going to call it <laughs> um, with this job, with this company, with this money situation. It's like making the best of what it is that you have, okay? So Scorpio, I love you and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.